Hello and welcome to the Heat Signature Daily Challenge for the 26th of November. Today we are bringing in three off-world security officers as fast as possible. We are frail and technophobe and silencer, which is a shame. Um, other than that, we've got concussion hammer, only three uses of a slipstream, which is a bit of a shame and an off-world angel that helps a lot. Um, helping with the frail is we are going up against off-world. So we only need to worry about contractors for the most part. This one's only got light reinforcements and we do need to be careful of shotguns. Alright, <clears throat> so I guess the goal here will be one slipstream per ship. And that is a weird entry spot. That might be a little bit annoying to get into. Alright, that worked out well. So, I need to run down here, probably throw a wrench. Or a hammer. Run down here, grab the key. <coughs> well, <clears throat> actually, we want to get. Hmm. There's unfortunately no easy way to get off of this. The only engines are way down there. So I think the fastest way here would be to go through the window. And I just, is that a three? That is, oh wait, this is a level two door. Okay. Hmm. This is a this is a day where I really miss the hammering through walls. But uh, all right, slipstream, go there. So with all the detour of right here, and having to worry about the center gun, this going down through here is probably a bit faster. And then the question is, <clears throat> well, I guess it's not a question. With this, I will set off the alarm. And I will have to be worried about that. I may need to use a stealth shield. But I do want to set the alarm off at any rate so I can come back and maybe loot and get a shotgun. <clears throat> or a really good shotgun. But, let's get started. <clears throat> Alright, we've got a key card. We can... Actually, I'm gonna ignore that one and go straight for this one. And... what? Huh. Oops, lost a tiny bit there. Not too bad. And then, yep, I can... I'm gonna take... Uh, can of shotgun first. I'll leave the pilot. Yeah, 
Yeah, we'll take this first. Actually, you've got a shotgun. charge in here. Maybe the hammer would have been better. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. I get you too. <coughs> Sorry. I'd like to get all three of you. I don't think that's happening. Luckily, I can pick up things quickly here. Two seconds before the defender arrives. I'm gonna get this a little bit in line. And that made me drop them, all right. <clears throat> all right, I want to get to here. seconds. I'm pretty happy with that. I think the only way to get to below 10 seconds on that would be to maybe use a use a second charge on the slipstream. But I did not want to do that. Sidewinder is good. Alright, I need to be wary of the jammer. Rechargeable subverter is great. Now, I've already got an automatic and a bunch of shotguns. So I don't necessarily... need a... Uh, need one of their guns. But it would still be nice to have. I think I will use a subverter on them and then just get through the ship fast. I don't like that, but I can turn this around. I think I can still use this here before it's finished. Nope. 
<clears throat> All right. That makes this a bit more difficult. I'm going to let them see me. Shoot, this may pull me out. That's all right. As it'll gather everyone away from where I need to be. And that's right, it's right there. So if I'd gone down here while I still had the Sidewinder, I would have been out of my way a little bit, but it would have sped up the capturing. But now that I have it, it will help a lot with the future ships. And now, let's see if, let's see, who had the key card? I think you did. Alright, put up. I'd like you to put up one. Alright. Oh, wait, Technophobe. I forgot about that. So, I actually don't want to do this. <clears throat> rather save that for something more important. Alright, we're getting a lot of stuff here, so let's go ahead and stack this a bit. The... Let's see, can I? Eh, I'm not gonna worry about it. Alright. Alright, on the next one, we got random kits and. Sh uh, normal guns, 20 seconds to escape, which shouldn't be a problem unless we get shot. Alright, so we've got... Should be an easy enough duck and... Got our target right there, Glitch Dash. So it's still a shame that we can't make any noise, but we can potentially have other guards make noise for us. Or just use line of sight to get them to teleport closer to a window or something. Anyways. And I overshot that. Five, not too bad. All right. Unfortunately, that's None of these are any good positions to get them jumping out of. But we've got the trap at least. That'll probably send them down here and then go out through this window. Uh, before then, do do have to go through here. 
Go through here, shoot. Because otherwise it's a really long way around. And we can shoot the guard, or pilot, and shoot everyone else. Alright, so we're pretty much running straight to here. <clears throat> I guess I should have at least one shotgun with me. And something messed up already. And this is a tad annoying. Didn't grab the key. Oh, this is a disaster. All right. <clears throat> okay, what can we do here? I'm gonna have to use my sidewinder. All right. So shoot you. This would have been an amazing daily for going through walls. Um, so I need to get down there first. And where are you heading to? I think there. All right. So we will. Hmm. Yeah, I can't use any guns because they're all quiet from other people. So I think I need to sidewind, sidewind, sidewind. Or do I just walk sidewind, sidewind? I guess it all depends on whether or not I think I can. What I think will take to get 20 seconds out. I guess if I'm using all three, I can use the third one to move down here. So I can wait on that a bit. Changing directions. If we weren't changing directions, I would start uh, getting that in position. All right. So, teleport. Start walking towards you. Let's see if you have any items to drop. A visitor. Let's pick you up. Drop you. Let's 
let's get you out here so that whatever's happening with the changing of the course doesn't get you thrown way off. While we're here, let's pick this back up. <clears throat> And then we can shoot the pilot. Sidewind. All right, so we've got nine seconds. We've got a visitor to get out of the third one. So as long as we don't screw up the slipstream again, we don't need a sidewinder and we've got two maybe three items left on this ship uh, Definitely gonna take less than 20 seconds or 11 seconds to get out of here if I walk. I guess I might not even be able to side one from here. So I'm just gonna give it a go. Alright, I can. And I need to wait to shoot. Them get <clears throat> away from the ship a bit and activate. And you're going in a weird direction. All right. All right, I'll let it get a bit further away. anything about you. So I'll just walk around you. And then what happened to my... Ah, the hammer is probably in the stash. Shield is good in an emergency, and then stealth shield is also good. So then last is you. I'm just gonna go out the window. why I'm more careful with that on missions. <clears throat> Alright, we got glitch shields and emergency shields and heat sensors. Alright. We got a tracker, defender, just a rather annoying ship. And I forgot to stack my pod a bit, but I'll just have to deal.
All right, it's got a port. We want to use the subverter on that. Do I want an emergency shield? That would help with the tracker. And I've got two uses of stealth shield on the pod, so I should be fine there. Uh, looks like we're not actually using the side one, but we can use it to open a later door. And then you yeah, have the emergency shield, lets us bypass the tracker easier. And we'll let that get a bit further away. past you uh, shoot you um, probably subvert you run by shoot Uh, I think we can shoot and then glitch trap visit out all right I think that's the plan where is the tracker right there so we don't have to deal with them All right, we've got a shotgun, a normal gun, and a hammer if we need, along with some backups. I am slightly worried about them. I might preemptively use a emergency shield. But aside from that, we are going to here. Getting an item from you. All right, well, it's worth a shot. <laughs> and then we've still got plenty of emergency shield left. No, oh, the alarm is target fleas. All right, so that get us a bit faster. Probably should have paid attention to that. Doesn't matter. Oh, thanks for taking them out, probably. Alright, we'll need to do a bit of finagling with that. Just in case, I will shoot. <clears throat> there. So, we might not actually have to bother with that key. We can just wait for them. And actually, if I stand right here, they'll teleport to me even if I get there early. So let's set a waypoint to here. Start. Getting out. All right. So we'll close the gap. Send you into space. Send myself into space. Remote, activate, 
Yeah, sadly we're not getting under 10 seconds, I don't think. Yep. But, 13 seconds for the last ship is a good time. So yeah, I had one mix-up on the second ship that <clears throat> might have actually ended up decreasing my time because it forced me to use the Sidewinder, where I definitely would not have used the Sidewinder on that last ship. So that does put me at first for the time being, with Kaysid and Redbeard not too far behind and then we'll have more people play over the next day and 42 seconds seems really good to me so we'll see if I'm able to keep hold of it as for yesterday we'll need to change galaxy and hope it doesn't crash it's crashing It, that that crash has been uh, very consistent lately. I wonder what it is exactly that's changed. Oh, and this time it. Okay. Oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah, it's grayed out because I can't do it here. All right. So yesterday was the 25th, and ah, uh, yes. So I would like to point out that I had the fastest time, at least. Yeah. I had the fastest time. I just made a mistake on the first ship. And I, I really should have gone for the brick on all three ships, but I was surprised that I did have the fastest because I didn't use the brick on the first ship, but that is what caused me to get seen twice. But, good job Renico for getting the fastest time, or er, fast high score, and for not screwing it up. And also to Doc, who... I'm not familiar with, and King Redbeard for third. Anyways, that is all for today. We'll see you tomorrow.